that one spotted. Corey and I are gonna try to make a move on him. He's a good, good distance away and we're in some pretty nasty terrain. So, we'll see if we can get close. He's a nice muley. go yeah I'm pretty upset before we dumped our packs and made the final hundred yard crawl I put two new batteries in the camera it's 20 degrees out here though and they don't really perform very well in the cold and as soon as he racked his last shell in to finish him off battery exhausted came across the camera so it's a nice muley though excited to go see him Got me a Montana slob, public land. Do all the big thanks to my old boss for tipping us off to this area. We run into hunters all, all week after Nick got his and it was uh, looking bleak. But honestly, we were planning on if this was spot was a bus going back and chasing this half rack we got on earlier this week. But we were uh, came back here, saw a couple of little bucks and uh, we were walking out and Nick, Nick walked up to the edge one last time to take a picture like he always does. And uh, I looked down and I saw his white muzzle from probably 1,200 yards away. And we made a heck of a stock. And his shot was 220 yards and I didn't make a good hit, but it slowed him down enough I could shoot at him to knock him down. <laughs> but I couldn't be happier. I've been coming out here for years and this is my first one I've actually got to take for myself, so. We got a heck of a ordeal to get him out, but it'll be fun. I came from the mud, there's dirt on my hands. Maybe. Strong like a tree, there's roots where I stand. Oh, I've been running from the law. Hope they won't shoot me down soon. Catch me howling at the moon.